characters and hobbies. And we've got a 3D figure here, which we're going to open up. We're going to right click and we're going to open with Bamboo Studio right there. And it's going to open up the latest Bamboo Studio. And uh, we've got a new release note here. Uh, we're going to download that. And kind of messed up my video here, but let's see if I can close this out. Quit. Okay, so we're back to uh, the figure. Let's just pull that over by right clicking. I'm going to make it a little bit bigger. Okay, and here he is. Okay, so as you notice, he's got overhangs which needs support, okay? So we're gonna go, we, the quality's good, the strength is good, the speed is good. Everything up here is set right. The nozzle, the machine 4.0, and the P1S machine. And uh, we're gonna speed of 20, which is kind of quick. Strength, speed, and we're gonna go to support. So we're gonna go to support, click in this little box here. You have normal support which you would put supports all through here. A lot, tough, but you wanna go really with a tree support, okay? And if, once you slice it, it may give you a warning. So let's see, we'll slice it. We'll go up to here and slice. So we're gonna slice it. And we're looking for an orange warning. We didn't get any warning. This is all the information of it right here. So you click here to, just, pull that out and there's no warnings so we're, we're good to go see how the supports went on there that's how it's going to print okay and then this is what this is the size of it right here okay I didn't show you the size but let's go back to prepare okay it takes the tree supports away right here in this box with this arrow going this way is the size. The size is 132 millimeters. You could take that figure, put it in Google, and switch it to inches. It'll probably come out to about four or five inches, the height of it. If you want to change that, make it bigger, you click in the box of the Z box, you wipe that out with backspace, and you put 150. Okay, and then you click in the Y box and see how it grew made it bigger okay so let's go back and let's we got our tree support set up over here and then we're going to slice it again hit slice okay everything seems to be okay no warnings or anything like that we'll just click this up get that rid of that you can click that out it, it gives you a, a tip down here you can lay it on the face it says um, to, it's all set to save so to save it you go to file export you go to exports plate sliced file click on that opens up the box you're gonna title it okay well you don't want to wipe out you don't want to wipe out it like that so let's cancel and we got to go back, export slice file, and hit your arrow key all the way to the to there, and just put in, type in Popeye. It's going to go to your desktop, so you know where your file is. Always put things on your desktop. They're always you always be able to find them. You know, don't put them in a subfolder or anything like that. So save. And it's thinking, it's on its desktop. You got the file ready to put on your card, or you could send it to the printer by print plate. Um, I suggest when you um, use print plate or send to printer, which is over here, it'll, it'll say, you know, send. You have the, your machine ready to send that file. Nothing on the machine no prints no previous prints on the machine so you hit send it and it'll send it wirelessly to your printer and it'll start printing it 
is and doing all the actions. Um, that's what I want to show you today. I hope you understand this. If you have any comments, please leave them in the comments below, and I'll try to answer them as best I can. And you have a great day, and God bless you. Bye for now.